All right, guys, Johnny Sunshine here. Getting ready to get on these leaves, man. First thing I need to do is uh, blow these leaves up onto the roof on my lanai at the entry of my house. Uh, and then go up there and get them on the ground. And uh, fun. I took, you know, three times the amount of allergy medicine. <laughs> I, I need or should take the recommended daily allowance. <sighs> You'll see once I get up there how it is. Another fucking intriguing video from Johnny Phillips. Alright guys, so I'm going to do a quick little assessment. Just what I thought. It's a big fucking mess. Terrible, man. Look at my nephew's roof. Just fucking covered. Now his knee is fucked up, so he can't get up there. Look at this shit, it's everywhere. Every inch of my property is covered, man. So I'm gonna do the best I can today. Get most of this shit on the ground. My lawn guy, he won't even call me back. He got suckered into doing this shit one time and he was like, fuck that, I ain't doing that again. Look at this. Get my carport. Just fucking incredible. Terrible, man. Brand new fucking roof, man. Just covered. This shit gets slippery up here, too, man. All right, let me get to work.
get the fucking idea. Alright guys, I got about an hour in. Uh, I've cleaned off the vast majority of my roof. I have this left to do, which is the toughest part. My nephew Nate's here. He's got the backpack blower. And he's going to blow all these fucking leaves off of here. Up onto the lanai. I mean up onto the roof. And I'm going to rake them. It's a problem, you know, because anything you do up here is going to take away from the life of the roof. Even just using the blowers, blowing granules of sand off, uh, gravel. So, yeah, I'm going to try to sell this place before I have to do this too many more times. You got to get that new air conditioner covered, have him turn it off. Before he gets over onto that side. So Johnny doesn't want to fall through the cage and split his head open and roll into the pool and die. Uh, so let me get at it, trying to get this shit off the roof. Johnny's fucking loving this. Living in Florida, it's the best. Not in these corners on any of these shelves along the side of the doors. Oh yeah, here it is, right here in front of me. Nate, what's that between the uh, in the ho near the hose? Or look in that garbage can. Nah, if it ain't on top, it's not going to be in there. Oh, my fucking God. All right, give me the fucking small one, then. Son of a bitch. Put it on that thing. This shit's not easy, boys. I've got many tools to take care of this place, man. Oh, here it is. Did you put the brush on it? No. Thanks. All right, watch yourself. That's what I got to do to this whole roof. All right, guys. So I've got one side done. I've got my house done, which really is only halfway done. Nate loves the blower. He, uh, it's easy, you know. I'm all done on this side. <coughs> the gutters are clean enough. And, uh, I'm going to go down and see what kind of mess I created on the ground. That's what I mean when I say it's only half done. Got this whole roof cleaned off. I had to use my, my pool broom right there. It's the only thing that's long enough to get out to the end. But uh, it's all good. Say hello, you fucking Winkelstein. He cleaned this whole thing around his house, but we haven't cleaned the roof yet, so it was all a waste of time. He's not a, he's a stupid visor, not a supervisor.
I want to get the shit done up on the roof, the hard shit. Nate, I need to get back up on the roof, man. Oh, gimpy ass fucking Heim Heimlich maneuvering son of a bitch, you. What? Huh? Nate, can you get that ladder right there and put it up? That ladder? Yeah. yeah my shirt. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nerp. 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 Plumbing. This is, what, this is what the sound nerp sounds like if you look at it. Nerp. Nerp. I make that sound when I squeeze out the last drip of pee. Nerp. All right, don't clean too much because we got to blow your fucking roof off. What the fuck, man? Kids of today, I tell you. Once I get this shit cleaned up, then I can get my, my uh, pressure cleaner out and do a real good job. Maybe even do these pavers. You should see how nice it looks when I surface clean these things. Lotty amazing. Here's my fireman's fucking ladder. Hang on, let me help me. Sign up to be a fucking cameraman. I'm a blow guy. James Brown on the roof.
All right. Hey guys, Johnny Sunshine here. The sun is still out. I've been hard at it for at least four or five hours. You can see that the leaves are all gone. I do need to get my pressure cleaner. There's still a lot of, I cleaned off the pool deck, but there's still a lot of this little fine oak shit in my pool. I need to vacuum out here. Uh, it is a monumental task, man. Do not underestimate how much work oak trees are. Yes, they're beautiful, but damn, you're gonna pay for that motherfucking beauty. Me and my nephew, we worked our asses off, you know. I gotta keep him on a short leash, which is great, you know. Just gotta keep him moving in the right direction. Not just looking busy, but actually accomplishing shit. That's the job of a supervisor. Uh, there are all kinds of workers out there. Some guys you can leave them and, you know, they've got a task they're trying to accomplish. There are other guys who are just trying to look like they're doing that, you know. I'm not saying my nephew's one of them, but he very well could be. So look at this. Johnny, the plumber who can't piss straight, now has a fucking water fountain that can't piss straight. Terrible. One stream. Fucking embarrassing. It's no big deal, John. Don't worry about it. I love you. Yeah. That fucking hurt. That's just passive aggressive to the fucking max. All right, so let's take a walk around. We'll see what we accomplished today. Oh, fucking hey, man. My feet are all, all fucking blistered from wearing these boatyard fucking getaways uh, with no socks on. They're like 12 sizes too big because they were cheap when they were on sale at the fucking homeless shelter. This is all clean. The leaves are basically pushed off to the side into the grassy area. I've got to I've got to really spend some time and clean this this area. This is a beautiful area. Uh, I just need to thin it all out, get rid of this shit because uh, I don't spend much time gardening, guys. I used to. Fucking drawers are falling off. You know them pants the Indian guys wear? With the crotch down right above their fucking knees? That's what I got. Look at this, guys. That's what I'm sporting today. Yeah. Uh oh. Anyways. The roof's nice and clean. Still got a lot of work to do, man. The lawn guys didn't show up this week. They cut my whole neighborhood. I was gonna have them do my house, but damn, I'm gonna get a notice from the fucking county telling me they're gonna repo my house if I don't cut the grass. That's what happens down here in Florida. But look at these fucking roofs, man. Nice and clean. Yeah. My, my girlfriend told me I have to mention that, see this beautiful bottle brush tree that's just in full bloom right now? She bought this and we planted it together. She bought the, this one next to it with the Q-tips and we planted that together. And I just needed to mention that. But these are, this is a beautiful tree, man. And this is just going to be an amazing bottle brush tree. It'll get to be like 25 feet tall. 
and every time I take a pee or poop and flush the toilet, I know I'm giving this tree a glass of water, nutrient rich. And then this right here is that that same bush with the uh, what you might call it, the Q-tips. And then over here. See these, these are beautiful, man. Eventually, these bushes that my girlfriend bought these two uh, will eventually take over this whole thing and cut off this passage. But look at the flowers, man, on this thing. They're just incredible, beautiful, and she's responsible for that. She brought a lot of happiness and beauty to this house. And, uh, yeah, I just love her. I just love her, man. Some of you may think Johnny's sucking up to his girlfriend. You're probably right. Just saying. So, it just feels cleaner around here. Uh, Johnny's flying that flag, guys. Don't ever forget it. Don't ever question my patriotism. I mean, come on. I got a plant growing out of a toilet. Look at this. Only a plumber would think of that. That plant grew all the way through the trap and down into the ground. I'll never be able to get the damn thing out of here. <sighs> A lot of hard work today, guys. But it was worth it. And I do love the trees, man. I just love the trees. So we're good for another year. Uh, here comes the mail. There goes the mail. Didn't even stop. What the hell? So I worked my ass off today. I'm sore. Uh, we filled up all the barrel available barrels that I have. Probably eight of them. Those brute barrels. Uh, I've had these barrels since the day I started my business. You know why I still have them? Because I use a hand truck to bring them out to the fucking edge of the road. I don't drag them. Little tech tip. These fucking things cost like 70 bucks a piece now. Uh, yeah, that fucking Joe Biden. Right down the trash cans. He's fucking, you know, making everybody rich but the American people. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, I've had these things for 27 years, man. They're like they're brand new. I will tell you that they're kind of a pain in the ass. You, These brute uh, barrels are designed to stack as many of them in a small space as possible. Not because it's convenient for us, but it's convenient for the people who make them. Dig it? So, if you own brute barrels... Every time you go near them, you will get covered in nasty, fucking stinky garbage water that's laying on the top of the lid, hiding in the fucking lip on the barrel, hiding in the fucking hand. So my suggestion is to go out there with a drill and drill some fucking holes in that prick so the water drains. Just one of them things, man. Sharing my fucking experience, strength, and hope. Let's all hold hand and say the serenity prayer. <laughs> That's a great prayer. And I need it. Let's flip this around. This is what Johnny's looking at right now. It's fucking a gorgeous, gorgeous day today. Is it still March? I hope so.
the fuck, I gotta get out of here, the buzzards are circling. They might smell death coming out of me. Look at these motherfuckers, they're circling above me, man. That's what happens in Florida. You better be moving at a normal rate or the buzzards will come. And they'll be circling just waiting for your ass to drop. And the first thing they go for, guys, legend has it, is the fucking eyeballs. They pluck your eyeballs right out of your fucking head. And you're like scrambling in a ditch. Crawling nowhere because you can't see. And then they just jump on you. Fucking terrible. All right, I got to go. I need my medication.